Saturday nights, it's time to stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Night Skills. It's Friday, April 12th. I'm Evelyn. And I'm CJ. And the, and the bulletin, bulletin is, is on. on. So, pep assembly today. Yeah, it's going to be pretty lit. I'm bringing all my screams and all my spirit. Y'all should too. Wasn't there a track meet yesterday? Yeah, there was. Bremerton, uh, North Kitts up in Kingston. Did you guys do good? Yeah, we did really well. You gonna be the first in the division yet? So soon, soon. All right, all right. Point one away. Yeah, we're getting there. CSF is taking 30 students on a field trip to the Clover Park Tech College Career Conference. This is open to all grades. The trip is on May 9th and the permission forms are due April 25th. Stop by room 231 to pick up a permission form. The Knights girls tennis team traveled to Port Angeles this week to take on the Rough Riders. The Knights got a big win from Karen Flanagan and Charlize Kabig at number one doubles and Maisie Monroe and Abby Steinwick at number two doubles. The Knights have a home match on Monday against North Mason at 4 p.m. Here is a photo of Mr. Webb attempting to stay warm while coaching. Way to go, Knights. Good luck next week. Attention all juniors, the Washington Comprehensive Assessment of Science, or WCAS, is Tuesday, April 16th at 7.30. This assessment is for all juniors. Students will report to first period on Tuesday and then be released to their testing location at 7.35. As with all state assessments, you are not allowed to have any electronics such as phones during testing. And you are not allowed to have backpacks or purses with you at your testing table. You may want to make arrangements to have these items secured in your locker prior to testing on Tuesday morning. If you are a junior, you are scheduled to take this assessment on Tuesday. The only exception is for juniors that have had a parent or guardian sign the test refusal form. Students' testing lists include testing locations are posted outside the counseling office. Please bring your fully charged Chromebook for testing. Did you know that if you have a part-time job and attend high school, you could earn CTE credit for working? That's right, stop by room 232 and talk to Miss Irish about worksite learning credit. If you already have a job, why not leverage that into some credit from school? Find out more by talking to Miss Irish. Are you planning to audition for the talent show? The next BHS talent show is fast approaching. Dance, sing, or perform your way to the stage. Auditions will be next Wednesday, the 17th, in the choir room after school. Be talented, y'all. Show up. BHS ASB will present the Multicultural Assembly and Festival on Friday, May 3rd. ASB would like to have as many cultures represented as possible. Scan the code and fill out this form if you would like to participate. Some of the options for performances could be song or dance representing a culture, poetry reading, or maybe a short speech about why your culture is important to you. If you would like to participate but aren't sure how, Please contact any ASB executive officer or ASB advisor, Ms. Erickson, and they'll be happy to provide support. That's it for today. Have a great Friday and weekend. Go, Go Knights! Knights.